If you guys want to make coins in FIFA this week, maybe double or triple your coins, this video is for you. Now, I am going on vacation on Thursday, so this video is being filmed on Wednesday, and I'm kind of predicting the content that I think is going to come out on Friday. I think I'm going to be correct, and if I'm wrong, you know, just ignore this video, but if I am right, follow along with this video and maybe keep an eye out on my TikTok and the free trading Discord. The links are in the description down below because I'll be posting any other investments specifically that I have on there. Now, we have... Team of the season, April 29th. There's a week in between that. So I'm thinking on Friday, we get a team of the season warm-up promo. Um, I think we'll see some, there's quite a few cards. I think a lot of SBC cards will do good. Players like the last video that I posted, I think can do good. I told you guys, I think the last video was how to double your coins in FIFA. I mentioned buying good 83s. That is going to be one of the main talking points of this video is good 83 overall cards. One example is Leno. I told you guys to buy this dude for a thousand coins. He went up to 3K. The market's coming down now. It's uh, Wednesday. We're getting, we had late night lightning rounds. I think we, we may have even had lightning rounds at content drop, but there is supply. So these cards are coming back down, but he was a thousand coins, went up to 3K, tripled our coins there. Another one was Kovacic. I tell you guys, Kovacic, Mesa Mountain, Aspi Laquit, they usually do really good. Kovacic, out of all of them, went up to 6K at one point, and then he sat around 4,000 coins for a good hour or so. But uh, let's go into why, sort of, whatever my prediction is for the Team of the Season warm-up promo. I need to make a window capture real quick. That's kind of annoying. You know what? We'll do this. Boom. Display capture, and we'll go full screen, and there we go. So... On to FIFA 22 SBCs. Look at this. Before Team of the Year, we had a Team of the Year warm-up promo. Uh, I think these were daily SBCs. I'm not 100% sure. They could have done the thing where, like, you get an SBC one day, you wait a couple days, you get another one. But, I mean, I think it added up to seven challenges, and seven challenges, you know, makes a full week. So it kind of somewhat makes sense. Um, so if we get daily SBCs, SBC solutions. If you guys know how to do with that, uh, players that are good for SBCs, like Akiko Femenia, there's some gold commons that do really good. Damari Gray, I don't know if you guys remember that. I think I talked about it in the other video. Easy whenever he's like 600, 700 coins around there, super easy to pick up. If we get good daily SBC challenges like these, uh, which one? Jumbo Premium Gold Players. I bet that was a very expensive team of the year challenge. Let's look at it. What were the requirements? 80 overall squad, 85 chemistry. Someone like a Grimaldo, uh, Pepe maybe, 82s. Any of those good SBC cards, like a Kappa could do good. Those cards could fly if we do get daily SBCs. And if you know how to SBC solution trade, it takes a little bit of learning, but you make your own solutions on Flipin and buy the players. You got to make the cheapest solution so everyone sees it. And then the players that you put in the solution go up in price. If you know how to do it, you can make a player that's 1K go up to like 5K. It's crazy. But uh, one of the things that I am keeping an eye out for, these, these 81 plus defenders, I don't think the 81 plus SBCs were anything crazy. I think they like had silver requirements in them. So that's something too crazy. But the 83 plus attackers is where it gets kind of interesting because 83 plus attacker, 83 plus midfielder, 83 plus defender. You might be like, why, why are we like looking at these? 83 overall squad. You go look at the other ones. I'm pretty sure they're 83 overall squads. Um, and then after that, they I think they released them twice as well. Like as soon as they expired, they released them again. Uh, 83 plus midfielders a little bit more than the other ones. Why was that? 83. That doesn't make sense. 21K, 13K. Oh, no. The defender one was the cheap one. That's why. But then... Uh, after those, they went on to release it somewhere. Where is it? 85 plus attacker upgrades, 85 plus midfielder, and 85 plus defender. Let's click the attacker just to see the requirement on them, and then I'll show you guys why I'm interested in this. One team of the week, 84 overall squad, 40 chemistry. So 84s could do good, but this also helps 83 sometimes. You know, if 84s go up a lot in price, maybe someone has like an 86 and they use the 83s or something like that. So 83s actually do really good with these as well. But I'm going to show you guys this real quick. Boom. Oh, it has to load. There we go. Uh, this was leaked. New packs added. What's this guy's name? Foot scoreboard, I think, on Twitter. Yeah, new packs added. So 
I'm thinking maybe we could be getting this before team of the seasons uh team of the season comes out so a 583 plus rated rare player pack 1181 plus la liga pack 280 plus rated rare player pack 1181 plus premier league pack i don't know if these would come out during the specific team of the season so say prem team of the season comes out the 1181 plus premier league pack comes out maybe that's what they're doing but uh bundesliga Serie A, 1575 plus ligun pack seems kind of crazy i'm not gonna lie because ligun uh, does not have that many gold uh, rares. So that could be a crazy pack to look out for. And then a 585 plus rated rare player pack from Premier League, Ligue 1, Serie A, Bundesliga, or La Liga. So I think, though, I'm guessing those SBCs might be coming out. What day is today? This week, this weekend, or, uh, you know, going into next week. Because sometimes... Friday, Saturday, Sunday, big SBCs aren't released. Uh, maybe Sunday, they release like icons sometimes, but usually Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday is when, and even Thursday is when they start to do casino SBCs, like an 85 plus player pick, uh, campaign party bag, stuff like that. The weekend, usually this year, they haven't really done too much. But that is why uh, I, I think, you know, these leaked packs, that's why I think we might get something like this, a team of the season warm up promo so uh we saw the requirements on some of these i'm not sure what they would do for requirements on these exactly but you know starting on friday you don't need to make your investments now i mean everything's up in price so making your investments now i mean you don't really have to do that because like look let's pull up a uh, kovacic another 83 that i talk about all the time even we pulled up Leno, 83 Premier League goalkeepers. You guys know I love those. Kovacic is really expensive. I usually tell you guys to get these 83s for around 1,000 coins. I think your best bet is keep an eye out for Friday. I think Friday is a really big day. Uh, whatever we get for content on Friday, you know, maybe we get lightning rounds. Uh, supply, SBCs. We, we notice we get a team of the season warm-up promo. I think if we get that team of the season warm-up promo on Friday, we're going to be getting daily SBCs. I would guess we should be getting maybe those SBCs that were leaked who knows but wait for friday make your decision then on investments and keep an eye out on the market i'm hoping they run lightning rounds through it i mean usually ea likes to drain coins off the market so i wouldn't be surprised if they run i don't know lightning rounds and drop as many good SBCs as they can so you guys go broke and buy more fifa points because ea wants to make money uh other cards though keep an eye out for good SBC cards dumfries does so good when those warm-up challenges like you saw the one that had an 80 overall but it was high chemistry if it's like 80 overall 90 chemistry and players from the same league max like four sometimes off nation uh off nation players in their league like a netherlands player in the Serie A can do really good keep an eye on these guys dumfries around a thousand coins grimaldo how's he been doing lately pepe as well how has Grimaldo been doing? I have not looked at his price. If this guy goes like below a thousand coins, it could be a really, he's cheap. Could be an interesting play. Keep an eye. Like I said, just wait till Friday. This is a guess right now. But you know, if my prediction is right, you guys could be making a ton of coins. Keep an eye out for the TikToks and <clears throat> Discord. But on top of like those 82s and 83s, you can also look at SBC cards. Um, there's a bunch of them. You can go off of just positions alone. You guys know I always talk about gold Premier League goalkeeper. You guys made a ton of coins off of that. I talk about gold Premier League left wingers. They go crazy. Uh, what are the goalkeepers at? About 1,200 coins. A big thing sometimes as well is if there's no good daily SBCs, maybe Friday and Saturday. Saturday night, Sunday morning, We depending on like where you kind of live, we get squad battle rewards and that brings a lot of supply to gold commons and sometimes these gold uh these goalkeepers get cheap the left wingers get cheap keep an eye out for these filters i like the left wingers a lot they're getting low definitely getting low if you can get damari gray especially for like 800 coins his bids might be real cheap 950 i mean we've seen what you guys have seen what he's spiked to he's been like 5k before just because of SPC came out that had a left wing and a left mid. He's a crazy card. If you're going to look at left wingers, Damaru Gay is probably one of the best ones from the Prem. Uh, what else do we have? Prem right back. There's so many other leagues. I just always go to the Prem because it's the 
Premier League. Premier League right backs. What are you guys going for? Ooh, they're kind of up a little bit. They're at a thousand coins. Just keep an eye on those guys. 500, 600. If they hit that, that's almost like invest a lot of coins into them prices. So that's the lower budget side. And then we also saw, you know, the 85 plus times five. You could look into 84s again every weekend you guys can just buy these 84s it's so easy i tell you guys all the time this is one of the easiest fifas to make coins on the weekend when there's supply i mean you know like i said i'm predicting we don't exactly know what's happening but if on the weekend you know we get lightning rounds stuff gets low again we can leave people open rewards i don't know um if this stuff gets cheap again you can invest maybe we'll get sbcs especially I mean, if they get low and there's not really a lot, holy mother meatballs, is that real? Wait, <laughs> okay. <laughs> Dang, he went up a lot. How much was he at content? Hold on, I need to look this up because I, I was buying him. If you guys watched the video, I said how to double your coins. I picked one up for like 3,200 and one up for 3,100, I think. So Telemans, what did he go to at content? He must've got really high. 5.5K right now, makes sense. At content, he went up. 5.7 he was like 6.8 on xbox at one point holy crap dang okay t lemons uh but yeah keep an eye on them i mean it, the thing is even if there's no supply if they come down in price that could be very um very helpful in making coins because say there's no supply but they come down in price but then those sbcs come out say there's less supply but the demand goes up a lot because it's, it's before team of the season people want a premier league what is it 11 81 plus premier league player pack or whatever the heck it was i don't what were the league packs 11 81 plus yeah 15 75 plus lagoon people were gonna craft those you'd be stupid not to going into team of the season so i don't know we've never really i don't think we've ever had spcs like that so i don't know requirements but like i think the 84 to 83 range is always so good to invest in if you want to maybe double your coins if you get lucky you can triple your coins once you get to the higher uh end of stuff the return isn't as high i mean I, I told you guys the higher i think i said in the last video the higher the rating you know cards might only go up like 2k 3k you make a thousand two thousand coins per card but instead of buying <clears throat> ten thousand eighty threes, you only have to buy 589s i don't know i just quick math whatever it is but that's basically it that's my prediction um if you have if you have any questions let me know in the comments like I said, I'm on vacation, so you guys can message me. I'm going to be on my phone a lot. I'm just going to be chilling on the beach, you know, um, drinking a coconut. I don't know what I'm going to do in Florida. But uh, thank you guys for watching. Any questions, Twitter DMs, Discord DMs, whatever you want. Thanks for watching. I'll see you all in about a week when I return on Wednesday. Peace.